I rather keep this particular store to myself, but for your own safety, I must tell you of uh, Agatha. Throughout her time here, both she and I grew close. Very close. We need to avoid her and look at her. Is that not... She's like, oh my... Agatha! Agatha! What? You were gonna marry that? Oh, should we get caught by Agatha? I feel like... Oh! Idiot! I forgot! <laughs> Blue candles! I'm not paying attention. Hey everyone! It's your friend, Think Noodles, and welcome to Midnight Made Night. Another Z Technician game. If you don't know who that is, that is the developer of The Man from the Window, also The Vermander Curse, also The Bit More No Zero. Uh, amazing horror games with plus sized characters and everyone and, and, and i'm gonna be super disappointed if he ever puts anybody skinny in any of his games let's get it started and he has just such like unique uh gameplay oh, there plus size already okay good naomi okay <clears throat> okay but really it makes sense first you replace a single plank on the ship then another and you keep going until everything has been replaced and nothing from the original ship is left. Then you ask, is it still the same ship? And if not, when did it stop being the ship of Theseus? Oh, you are even bigger. <laughs> Wouldn't it be easier to just build a new ship instead of going through all that? Ruth, that's not the point. It's a thought experiment. Well, if you ask me, Theseus needs to quit thinking so much and go to stop his ship from being dismantled. Maybe that's the point of all this. Don't get distracted by silly little details when someone's out to get you. I don't... I think we're getting off track here. Oh! Hold on. My phone's going off. Oh, I thought she was human! She's got a huge claw there! She is not... I mean, obviously, you're not. Uh, Ruth isn't human. But Naomi has got, like, a dragon claw there. Shoot! What's wrong? Our two o'clock just canceled on us. Oh, why is that? I'll read her message for you. Okay, so like, gotta cancel the appointment. Owner found out and isn't happy. Says she'd rather clean the place herself. Oh, maids, I get it. And that was our last appointment for the month, too. There is one more we could do. Nope, nope, we're not doing that one. Well, we have to do something here. If I miss one more payment, they're gonna take the van. And it's, it, this is, oh, right, and Beware the Shadow Catcher. I played that as well. I completely forgot that until this one. Uh, if you guys remember that, the, the diner was going to go under, and we had to we had to help the shadows. Uh, uh, th that's the end of Midnight Maids. And I don't think either of us wants to start looking for a new career at this point. Ruth, you're killing me, I swear. Oh, come on now. We don't even have to clean the place. Just move a few boxes, drop them off afterwards. We'll be in and out before you know it. Oh boy, you guys, you guys moving drugs, aren't you? Let's go. That's the Naomi I know. We'll be there in no time. Okay. So, will it be like Beware of the Shadow Catcher where we go in between them? Oh, she is gigantic. <laughs> what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Oh! Oh, you were a chicken. I thought you were a dragon. So you're a so so Naomi is some sort of chicken woman. And, uh, and Ruth is a cockroach. I was, I'm already getting bad vibes from this place, man. I'm not too thrilled about it either. Uh, okay. But the sooner we get started, the sooner we can get out of here. I know, I know, it's just... Oh, there's a map. All right, what's first on the agenda? I'll check. The estate has been sold and the previous owner's possessions are being auctioned off tomorrow. We hired some movers. But they unexpectedly left a few hours into the work and haven't replied back yet. The previous owner is currently unavailable. So I need you to finish up the job. All you need to do is pack up whatever items are still left and drop it all off at my place. You have a more empty boxes than you'll need to use. You may put any unneeded boxes back on the bench. Sounds easy enough. You can send them a message and let them know we're here. I'll start packing up in here first. Okay, so we're playing as her. So yeah, I think we are going to switch between them. By the way, they sent some instructions for this room. Pack up the books. Pack up the old letters. Books, old letters, papers. Uh, there are more instructions for the other rooms here. Just talk to me if you want to hear them, okay? Okay. So... Ho, ho, ho. Okay, what is all, what is this? Come on. 
Wait, these are these look like old papers. How do I pick them up? Oh wait, I probably have to pick up a box. Yeah, okay, okay. And then pick up the old papers. Papers. These look old. Old, 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 old. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is gonna be tedious. Now, is that older? Oh, that's a book. Can I put it in here? Oh yeah, okay. I'm gonna. Can all of this? These look like. Oh my word. These are not really letters. These are postcards, but maybe it counts. Let's see what happens. We fit everything into this one box. And what's so there's got it. There's always a horror element to these games. So, uh, okay. So where do I put it back? Do I, do I take it out here and put it in the van? This box isn't full. Okay. Yeah, but, um, oh, book. Aha, I did it. Okay. So that's what happens. There we go. That's the room taken care of. Now I better go ahead and take the box out of the van. Be right back. Sure thing. Okay, uh, so I don't know if I had to like keep track of what she told me to get because oh, Hello, whoa, who are you? Oh Hey, Ruth, you didn't tell me the old homeowner would be here Scared me almost half to death when he showed up Terribly sorry about the fright ma'am Though I do have a question. I feel I must ask your attire suggests you're here for work But please tell me has something happened my friend and I were contracted to move things out before the new owner shows up. New owner? So we finally lost the estate then. I should have known. But never mind that. I must suggest you two return in the morning. Things tend to get very, very strange in this house at this late hour. Tomorrow? I can't do daylight, and I'm nocturnal. So we, so we only work at night. <laughs> Screwed up the voices. Besides, if we don't finish this job tonight, we don't get paid. I see. I see. Well, can't have that. In that case, you'll need to keep a close eye out for my father during your work. The man had his fair share of demons in life, and in his current state, he's only gotten worse. But don't worry. The lights in this mansion tend to react to the energy he gives off. Should they begin to glow blue, then you need to know he's on his way. I'm sure you'd like to know what you should do at that point, right? Well, a family such as ours has had a share of enemies. <gasps> Whoa. And because of this, every room in this mansion has a secret alcove that can be used to hide inside. My father has long since lost the presence to mind to check these hiding spots, so you'll be safe therein. I wish I could tell you that he's not as bad as he seems, but he is, so it's best that you just avoid him outright. I'll leave you both to get back to your work. Just pretend I'm not even here. I'd like for the record to show that I'm not okay with any of this. Naomi, hush, we'll be fine. Thank you for your help, sir. We appreciate it. it. Oh, he gone. He's left already. He sure is a strange one. And the understatement of the year award goes to me. Oh, okay. So what are we doing? What's up? Check time. Okay, it's 2 a.m. The new homeowner is supposed to get here at 6, so we need to finish up before then. We still want to get paid. Okay. Uh, check the room status. This one's fine. Okay, so we got everything. So, uh, oh, oh, okay. I'm follow. Oh, you're following me? Are you following me with the flashlight? Oh, you are. Okay. Bring your chicken hands over here. All right. So I, I feel like now in the, in these games, in his later games, there's always multiple endings. So I feel like we want to at least get caught once. I see right here. So, oh, okay. Oh, he back. One would not be able to tell it now, but our dining room used to be quite the grandiose sight. All manner of patricians have graced this room, though I sometimes wonder if they would still have visited had they known what truly went on here. Oh, red wedding. Um, so I didn't bring a box, which was pretty stupid. But again, I, I think we, we, oh, blue. All right, cool. So I, th I would go hide there. Well, we should see how you hide there, right? Oh, wait. Oh, he's going to get us. Because like I said, oh, what, uh, is that the ending? Because like there's multiple endings in his games, in his later games. So I wanted to just see, oh, that's it. Faced with no other acceptable alternatives, the Midnight Maids ventured into a place brimming with bad omens. And though this was nothing new for the duo, one's luck can only be tested so many times before the worst eventually happens. The estate and its dark, unresolved secrets proved 
to finally be too much. A mansion with a closet already full of skeletons now added two more to its grim history. Six restless spirits now reside therein. Okay, so that would be us. So four others and us makes six. So I think we have to rescue four spirits. Okay, so I thought we might get a jump scare with that. So if I if I continue, I think we can skip over the intro stuff. All right, so yeah, let's grab a box because that's what I should have done in the first place. Does she actually have a flashlight or is it just her phone? I think it's just her phone. Okay, so what we want to do, I believe, uh, is go over here. How do we pop this? Okay, so that's how we get in. Okay, cool. So you can't just leave it open. You actually have to go over to it and click it open. All right. Now. Oh, jeez. Go, 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 go. We got to go. We got to go. Blue, 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 blue. Okay, okay. All right. So now do we get this? How do we know? Oh, okay. So that's where he starts. Ah, so that's why it showed... It literally showed our face because that's where he was and he caught us immediately. So we don't even get to see him attack. We didn't get to see him attack. I need to see him attack. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna let him attack us though. So I, wait, tell me what we need. Actually, uh huh. Uh, the message that is pack up the table placements, pack up the gold trays. Okay, so yeah, you just collect everything. I mean, oh my goodness, holy cat! So like that's annoying. Oh, okay, so now he's gonna get us. Let's see him get us. All right, he comes in. There he goes. Yeah, come on. Yeah. All right. So that's that's us being attacked. It's super scary. <laughs> so he comes a lot. Uh, I didn't even notice that the lights were turning blue. So I got to pay a lot more attention to the candles. And that's where this developer's uh, like mechanic style really comes to like shine a lot of the times because he makes you get really focused on clicking on, on all these little small items, right? Um, and, uh, oh yeah, see, 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 look at that. Jeez. And you forget that you have to check these things. So you're, you're focusing, 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 and these are turning blue right in front of you. You have no idea. It might be that he like starts, starts his cycle always in this room. So once we hide from him, his cycle ends. Oh, oh geez. Oh dear. I don't think I can carry anymore. I should take this box out to the van. How about we hide? How about we hide? Jeez. He is really quick though. So we got to go out to the van and it's going to take multiple boxes. Also, I believe a timer is running. So, oh, oh, so there's going to be a second ending here where you run out of time. So I think I'm just going to hang out in the closet until that happens. Yeah. So, uh, oh, geez, it's only 209, though. We, we want to see that ending, right? Oh, I don't know, man. All right. All right. We're, we're, we can do that at the end end just to see if there is an ending when you run out of time. Find out what the good ending is because there are so many different ones. We know where that hiding spot is. We don't have. OK. Oh, wait, what? Oh, whoa. OK, that was not. Oh, I wonder if he. Oh, we got to hide because I don't think that gate works. Come on. Jeez. This is not easy. All right. So he passed us. Now, what I want to see here also. Okay, let's grab one of these. Grab that. What do we? So, okay. So circle just means a room that we have to go to. Um, hey, what's happening? What happened? What happened? What happened? Oh, you back. You both seem quite adept at this. The, that other group of movers had already turned tail and ran by now. Cleaning houses is usually our specialty. But sometimes we have to work, take other jobs as well. And then I, and then I get dragged into some insane situation just because we need the money. Like last month, we almost got buried alive in the church's basement. How does one end up in a predicament like that? Good question. Maybe it's because someone accepted without reading the entire job description. It said groundbreaking work, didn't it? How was I supposed to know? Do you see what I have to go through? Mama. You two sure are something else. I wish we had more help like you during my time. And where are my manners? I never introduced myself. Oh, yeah, you're right. You didn't. My name is Joseph. Joseph Vermander. And if you guys haven't seen the Vermander curse, uh, go check that out. Uh, but he's related to the Vermanders and the Vermander curse. I'm Naomi. She's Ruth. It's an honor to meet you both. And he does look like a Vermander. 
I don't mean to delay you, really. Just nice to finally have someone to talk to after all this time. I'll let you two return to your work. Okay. Thanks. Okay, so let's 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 finish off a room. I think what'll happen is we'll get the X like we did in the other room. You just gotta like when you go from like actually after every item you should probably check. I didn't check. And he does that on purpose. He puts it like woo! He puts it right below your sight line. So you do have to look up uh to vertical well not vertical, but full horizontal before you can see it. Dang, this is gonna take ages. If it takes this long. Maybe this is the hardest, like the most, like in, uh, most number of items in one room. I should have counted the number of times I clicked. But this is gonna take at least three boxes, right? Oh geez. Oh dear, I don't think I. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. All right. We got it. So we've got to. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Do we have? Oh yeah. So why is there a sprint key? Why would you ever not want to sprint? Okay, so we got that. Let's grab that. Do we have blue? No, we're good. Okay. So a little bit uh less often, or maybe he's picking other random rooms. Nope. Oh, nope, we gotta go. I saw that. I saw that. I don't know how long we have before, but yeah, once it's blue, you gotta go. Alright, so what I, what I'm thinking too is once you've cleared a room, hopefully it sort of saves your uh, I don't know, that might not be true. Hopefully it saves your progress. It are we gonna get a four boxer or we got three? Alright, there we go. He's full, let's go. Wait, it didn't say it's full though. Wait, can we check the status real quick here, Naomi? That's it, we got everything. Okay, you could have told me that. You did it with an animation before. I mean, I guess the box sort of disappeared from my hand, so that's what we'll use. Oh, no, 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 no. That's what we'll use in the future to, uh, to know if a room is clear. All right, there we go. That was a three boxer, right? Yep, okay, so next box. So where's the next place we're going? All right, do we have an X? Huh? We don't. Wait, what? So then hold up. Where are we then? I, I don't know what this X is for. Wait, what does this map mean? Hold on. We need to look at this then. So, there's, oh, geez. Let me look at the map, man. I'm just trying to study the map real quick here. So we have a hallway, two offshoots, and a room up the center. I don't know if that map matches anything. Hallway. Ah, I can't see it. Hallway with a, oh with a room at the end no but there's two rooms at each end oh maybe here oh yeah that well no but there's nothing dang I don't know man I don't understand the map okay maybe the, I don't know what I'm looking at in that map but um, what this place is huge oh hey what's up buddy I feel like he's a safe point many a thankless meal has been in this room. While I, of course, did my best to respect the help, father wasn't always as accommodating. God forbid you incorrectly cooked a meal on one of his bad days. The ashes contained in that oven aren't just, uh, from the wood, you know. Oh. Oh. Okay. I don't think y'all should be doing that sort of thing in here. Oh, so pick up. We're putting boxes in the boxes? Is that, is that what we're doing here? Oh! Holy cow! Check room status. Okay. But I gotta, I gotta hide. I gotta hide. I gotta hide. <gasps> Dude, he came really fast. Okay, so that like that big room or the, the, the dining room might have been the hardest room of all just because of all the stuff in it. This only had three items. So we'll keep going left and keep uh, filling that one or emptying that one. Now, ooh, do I, they said I had more, oh, weird. Okay, so I picked up more boxes. Huh. Okay. So, if I was carrying three boxes, could I fill have filled three boxes from another room, or would that have been it? Oh, this. Okay. The dead end. That's bad. If we get a blue candle here. <gasps> okay. Uh, what are we supposed to do in here? Oh, we. Oh, we collecting candles. Okay. Um, let's pick up the candles and the the, the deer heads, and um, let's check for the light because this is not a room. Probably he wants us in. This looks bad. Real, real bad. Um, no blues, no blues. Okay. Oh, we got blues. We got blues. Grab that. No, no, no don't, don't even bother. Don't even bother. We'll get on the way out. Okay. So we got, we got a clean room here. We clean. Naomi. What we got? I think that's it. Let's get out of here. I don't like this room. Ooh. So she says something different. I, I see. Okay. Yeah. Let's. Okay. So we have to go all the way back around to that room also, uh, and pass it for a different room. Ooh, dude. This is maze like. 
So did we get it? Oh, hold up. Mm, I don't know. This box isn't full. Yeah, well, I know. Okay, so we can go to multiple rooms without a full box. But look, that... Uh, these aren't circled. Were they ever circled? Oh, no! Oh, I blew it. Oh, dude. All right. Some more attention. So we definitely... Okay, so let's open that. We got a box. Let's... Get out of the way, Naomi! Oh, no, no. Wait! Could be good. It's getting rather late, which means I should probably tell you about Cornelius. Who? Long time ago, he used to be one of my father's servants. A true paragon of a butler. But I haven't had one bad word to say of the man. But one cold January morning, a terrible blizzard arrived. You and I both know how rare snow is here. The entire town was shut down. Our family had absolutely everything one might need in an emergency. Food, water, enough firewood to last for days. However, father wasn't happy, for the man was accustomed to reading his newspaper every morning. Given the conditions outside, the paper obviously couldn't be delivered that day, but instead of occupying his time doing something else as the same person would, he sent poor old Cornelius out to retrieve the paper morning, morning paper in the town. Father didn't even have the decency to get a man a winter coat to use. He just sent him out wholly unprepared. Suffice it to say, Cornelius didn't return. Man met his untimely demise out there in all the ice and snow. And now, something appears outside every night past that gate. Something that used to be Cornelius. I don't know what happened to him out there in that blizzard, nor do I know what he wants. But when you venture outside, be sure not to stay out there for too long. Otherwise, you may very well end up face to face with him. That would be another ending. We're going to do that. Let's do that. Come on. Come on. Naomi. Wait, what time is it, Naomi? Because that's another thing. Like, things get added. Okay, 2.52 a.m. we still got plenty of time. So, yeah, that, that's usually what happens as time goes on. So outside this gate, there he is. Oh, dude, is it Sans? Hey, Sans, what's up? Hey, nice to meet you. Hey, you gonna help me? Um, yeah, uh, excuse me. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh, Cornelius had patiently waited many years for his revenge. In his current state, his vision was extremely limited, and upon seeing two figures outside the manor. He reasoned one of them must be the one he searched for, but it's not. So he lunged squish, and took her out. However, neither figure turned out to be the one he searched for. So he offered up an apologetic gesture, then prompt, promptly slinked off back into the night. Both Naomi and Ruth were unharmed, although a fair amount of time had been wasted in the incident. Oh, yeah. What? Yeah. Oh, jeez. How much time? Check time. Oh, dude, like half an hour. Oh, well, that was stupid. That wasn't... Oh, my God. Well, I thought that was an ending, so let's go. Well, that was dumb. <laughs> ah! <laughs> he knew I... See, that's the thing. He knew I was going to do something like that, I bet. He's like, oh, yeah, people are going to try and get an ending there. Is there boxes? No. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Hide, hide, hide. All right, so what's around this corner here? Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is involved. This oh no, there's multiple levels. Oh, this is bad. Okay, this is really What? Come on! This place Oh and I got caught! <gasps> right, this, this goes straight. Okay. We'll just oh, okay, there's candles down here. Oh, pick up boxes, huh? But wait, there's like oh whoa, there's something back here, dude. What? There's like a trap door? Okay, this is, um, wait, why can't, oh, I can, oh, I can only pick up a certain number of boxes at a time. Okay, so I gotta come back down here, but there, there's also something behind one of those crates. What is that? Like, uh, is he gonna turn enough that we can see it? I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't think so. Okay. Looked like we could push something. <sighs> really sucks that I had a box already. So there's one extra that I have to come back and get, but look at this. There's, there's definitely something here. Can we push this? Look at that. There's something there. What's up? I don't know, dude. 
The message says take all the boxes out. There's still more stuff to grab in here. Yeah, but we can't make it. Yeah, there's definitely extra boxes. All right. Now, the other thing is two. Um, so we're going to go back and drop these boxes, but I want to go back to that yard because I feel like there's some reason that we're supposed to explore there because he doesn't come through the gate and he it, it, we had a bit of time to escape him going through the gate. So let's do that. Okay. So there's three box. Oh, this box isn't full. Yeah, no kidding, Ruth. All right. So do we. All right. Well, let's do this. Oh, he's there. Okay. So we've got to like. Hold on. So if we, he's going to walk away. I hear him taking steps away. Can we? Oh, no. Wait. Oh, oh, oh I wonder if he'll. No. This is weird. Because I feel like we got to get out there somehow. Hold on. And I did open the gate. Maybe I push up against it. I didn't see uh, an interactable red dot. But I felt like I got out. But, oh, okay. So he's opening the gate. Okay. Come on. So he opened. No, I just wasted more time. Did I? No. Okay, so maybe ugh, I just wasted more time. Let's go a different way. I mean, I have, I probably have to. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is new. Okay, let's get that. Plate, plate, plate. I didn't find the thing, dude. Where's the thing? Okay, it's over there. Oh, 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 oh. Grab the painting. Those count too. At least I can like sort of identify. This room is a little bit different than the other rooms and hallways, right? So we don't, or at least at this point, we don't switch. Let me just check the status of this room. Cause yeah, okay. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go this way. Oh dear. Oh dear, not that way. Oh, bathroom, okay. Let, oh! Will it fall? Okay, we're gonna, I need, oh no. Oh, there's a mirror, weird. Cool, look at that. Hey, look at us. We're so cool. Uh, okay, here we go. Come on. You do all this like fancy stuff. Oh dear. I don't think I can carry anymore. I should take this box out to the van. Okay, can I take it with these boxes too? Bam. Okay, let's do this. Um, because I feel like, yep, I knew it. Oh, there he is. That's what he looks like. Did you see him? He was in the mirror. We finally saw what he looks like. He looks like he's a vermander. I'm pretty sure he's a vermander. Well, obviously he is. Duh! It's his dad! He's a vermander, so therefore his dad must be a vermander. He just looked older and fatter. Okay, so I guess what it means is I gotta do this really fast, and then we just gotta go. Oh, oh, and we can't camp out there either and hide from the blue light. Oh, what? <laughs> I don't want this to keep going. Why does it keep going? What's this? Oh, I knocked over a table. I thought it was a coffin. Are we good in this room here? Oh, all right. Well, that's good. Oh, wait. There are no... Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's wait for the candles to turn blue so we can... Uh... Dude, I don't... No, no, no. I got to do this here because it's been too long. Yep, yep, okay. That's what I thought. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go down this long hallway here. Is I wonder if this is the same hallway. It might be. Okay, we can't pick up any more boxes. Well, that is unfortunate. Okay, that might be the same hallway. So it's linking back. Why is that lit over there? Oh, yeah, look at it. She's got four boxes. Oh, wow. Oh, because she's got all the arms. So wait, why is this lit here like this? What's, oh, man. Oh, hello. Hey, that's why. It's like a plot point here. Save uh, point, maybe. A vast selection of tomes and books used to be housed in this room. We collected all over generations, so much knowledge, yet somehow, despite it all, we still weren't clever enough to save ourselves. Ooh. Wait, what? Oh dear, I don't think I can care anymore. I should take this box out to the van. Yeah, okay. Could have told me that before. Oh, what just happened? Oh, again. I have one final thing to tell you both. I'd rather keep this particular story to myself, but for your own safety, I must tell you of, uh, Agatha. Agatha used to be part of the help. Like Cornelius, she too was an exemplary servant. Throughout her time here, both she and I grew close. Uh, very close. And despite knowing full well the impact it would have on my family's social status, I asked her to marry me. She and, then, she and I then planned to elope and run away together. I didn't care I was giving up my inheritance by doing so. I only wanted us to be together. But the night before we were to make our escape from this awful place, 
father found out. Again and again, I asked him, where is she? And what are you doing? He eventually answered me, though sometimes I wish that he didn't. He told me she was under the floorboards where she belonged. Then he went on about his day, reading his newspaper and having his breakfast like nothing happened. Agatha didn't deserve to end up like this. She'll probably wake up soon. Should you see the candle suddenly go out, you'll know she's in the same room as you. You know, I still try to talk to her, but she never responds. I don't think she recognizes me anymore. She just runs away if I look at her. Okay, there we go. That's what we do. I thought we were going to have to dig up his girlfriend or fiance, I guess. Yeah, uh, but no, we need to avoid her and look at her. Is that not? She's like, oh my, Agatha, Agatha, what? You were going to marry that? Oh, should we get caught by Agatha? I feel like, oh, idiot. I forgot the <laughs> blue candles. I'm not paying attention. No, we want to get attacked by Agatha just to see if that's an ending. Probably it'll just waste more time, but we're doing it. Where is she? Yeah, give me. Oh, she, she won't kill you. So. Uh, I don't understand uh, what we're supposed to be scared of from her. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, and so now she's in with us, right? And I didn't look at her. Maybe she'll get us out of the closet. Because she's in this room. Is he going to see her? Run right. Oh, no, she's not there. Maybe I maybe I got her out. I oh! What? Oh, I thought I died. What was that? Was that like an illusion? Am I losing my mind? What in the world? Oh, man. You know, I... I, I okay. We got, we're going to get blue here. I think... Oh, okay, wait. Where is she? Where is she? Oh, okay. Oh, my. Okay. All right, all right. Where is she? I wonder if we should follow. Oh, oh, the royal bedroom here, huh? This mansion has been in our family for generations, you know. After my father finally met his Bruh. and everything went to me. You mean your father is chasing us around here? Okay, so he is a zombie. That's why his skin is so ashy. During the time, my time, I tried best to correct the past sins of my family. The help were treated fairly for once. I lowered the prices on all our properties. I even tried returning all those liberated artifacts. Oh, we used to keep down in the basement. I was well on my way of pulling my family name out the mud, you know? But then somehow, Bobby became so enraged by my actions, he brought himself back from the dead to stop me. To be honest with you, I wasn't even that surprised. He broke just about every law he could while, st while still alive, breaking universal laws with the next logical step. Okay, thanks for the, uh, the info, bro. Okay, so we can't... Oh, 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 hello, 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 hello. Okay. Oh, we got blue. All right, let's hide. It's like, who cares if she's in the room with you? Okay, so she's in the room. Oh, I know. I get it. Oh, I, I see why that's a problem. I see why that's a problem. The candles go out. You don't know if he's coming. <gasps> Wait, circles are disappearing. The map means something. I just noticed the map looks different. Look, 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 look. Here, here, here. Here we go. Look, look, look. Yes. All right. So... Wait, but the thing is, I there, there's a oh, that's like that doesn't go out that way though, does it? Doesn't it shouldn't? It looks like it's just a closet there. See if there was a that part right there, I think is inaccurate. Uh, okay, so that is the same hallway. Okay, now it makes sense. So we got the, that's the basement thing down there. I don't know, maybe. Oh jeez. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Will you, will you, will you get your eyes? Out? Yeah, I'm gonna catch you. Oh jeez, jeez, jeez. Bye. See, that's where the problem comes. Okay, one room left. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, that one. Okay. Oh, yeah, this one. Because I came in here, but I... Oh, man. Okay, this is... Where Where are you? Where are you? You suck. Don't do that in this room. I don't even know where the... Where's the... Oh, dude. Where's the... Oh, we got to hide, I think. No, not yet. Okay. There we go. Yeah, we do now. Okay, yeah, the library. I forgot about it completely. It's going to take multiple runs through here. This is like the dining room. Of course, it's left for last. So many books, dude. We're going to fill it up in a second. It's going to be full. Yep, that's what I thought. Ruth. Ruth, you got a you got a six old six big fat arms, man. Actually, your arms are skinny. How much time do we have, Naomi? Ah! Yeah, that's not good. No, it ain't. 
Wait, I could take that candle? Really? Oh! What just happened? I think I got the last book! Come on! Go! <laughs> Leave it already? Yep, we're all done here. Thankfully. No offense, my guy, but your house creeps me out. Haha, <laughs> I suppose you're right about that. This place does get quiet, get all quiet, the uh, oppressive atmosphere. Still, I'm gonna miss it. This is the only home I've ever known, you know? But it's high time for me to move on. There's no point in haunting this place a moment longer, for our time here is over. I have to thank you both for helping me realize that. Without you here, I suppose I never would have talked to myself, talked myself through my own issues. You're very welcome, dear. Honestly, this is nothing new for us. We usually just tack another 50 bucks on to the bill when someone's spirit, uh, when we help someone's spirit move on. I'd expect nothing else from the Midnight Beans, I suppose. It's been fun. Goodbye, my friends. Where do you think you're going? Uh-oh. Wait, come on. This is good ending. Oh, he looked like Granny. You're not going anywhere, my boy. You know what, Father? No, I'm done with you. My whole life has revolved around you. Spent my entirety of my youth trying to best please you. You only thought of yourself. But I spent the rest of my short time here trying to invade to atone for your evil deeds. I refuse to let you ruin my afterlife as well. That's it. Oh, they're all ghosts. <gasps> uh oh. Oh. That's his girlfriend, Agatha. Look at her. <laughs> ah. <laughs> sure took you long enough to come around, Joey. Agatha? You, you still remember me? Why haven't you said anything until now? I was waiting for you to finally stand up to the big oath. Oath, not oath. I thought giving you the solid treatment for a while might help you figure it out, but no. Well, better late than never, I suppose. Exactly. Uh, now, come on. Let's leave this place behind. Yes, we must depart at once. You wouldn't dare. Want a bet, old man? Punch, Punch him in the face. face. Oh, happy ending. Right? Sorry, Grandpa. He does look like Grandpa, right? This is your fault. If you didn't listen to him ramble on, he'd still be here with me. You're gonna pay for that. Do we run? Get him! Get him! Oh, you're getting it, dude. This is a really good ending. Yeah, there you are, sir. Here's that newspaper you wanted. I asked for this paper years ago, you useless idiot. Not even a thank you, huh? Well, that's quite all right, sir. I have brought you something else as well. Would you like to know the weather forecast? What? The weather forecast, sir. There's a heat wave coming. I thought you should know. Burn, baby! Oh, what is this? No, I will not go yet. My legacy, I must preserve it! Yeah, dude. We friends? Are we friends? Righto. Now that it's finally sorted, I'd better take my leave as well. Stay safe out there. Bye. Dude, completely unhaunted. All the ghosts are gone. That is best ending possible. Never a dull moment, huh? Not by a long shot, my dear. Not by a long shot. And they lived happily ever after. The end, right? <laughs> the Midnight Maids. Now, I'm wondering if I... So we'll get a star at least on this. Right, do we? Because he usually does like... Yeah, he does the one star. Oh, no! Okay, because I was thinking I could continue and just advance it to 6 a.m. So what I'll do... Oh, is I'll run through this real quick, and then we'll just go outside to the guy who keeps advancing time, and then we'll get to the uh, once he appears. So do we have to actually do stuff before he appears, or? Yeah, we have to do all this. Okay. All right. 2,000 years later. Ah, here we go. We ran out of time. So I, I could not figure out how to open that door. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. But uh, I, I deliberately failed. So the duo worked throughout the night, right up until the last moment. However, they were unable to meet their agreed upon deadline. As the clock struck six, the new homeowner arrived angry that the mansion wasn't in the previously promised condition. The pair promptly left, leaving the disgruntled homeowner behind to deal with the untidy home and four restless guests, which are 
the ghosts, obviously. Uh, they were not paid for their efforts. Though they left the mansion unscathed, they were unable to find more work before the month's end. And the Midnight Maid's van was repossessed soon after. Having no way to continue their work, the two parted ways. They both eventually landed new dead-end jobs to make ends meet. Despite the inherent danger of being the Midnight Maids, they both truly missed their time working together. That's the sad ending. They, 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 they miss. Do I get a second star for that? Or nope. You still, you still just get the one star. Ah, I really want to get into the basement. If you guys know how, let me know in the comments below. If you guys enjoyed the video, do subscribe. And I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching. And of course, new line.